Good morning, we're now here in Ireland, uh, the world famous uh, uh, horse champion, champion, uh, the racers, of course, horse racing, you know, horse racing, yeah, these uh, were the world's fastest horses came er, and, and made, okay, as you can see, they have a uh, separate separate uh, what they call this I don't call this a cage okay I don't know uh, what they call it here but for me it is still a cage you see once you cannot uh, move then uh, your freedom is limited okay I call it a cage so it's not fun to be a horse okay See, they have their own cages here. They have their own names and uh, their titles. Yes, uh, you can see here in every uh, fences, the races, they won. All from Ireland. Yeah, the finest race horses were made in the world, of course, in the world. Okay, as you can see, it's very cold here in Ireland, no? This horse is wearing a jacket. Okay, you see the jacket? See, even the horses, they get cold also, of course. Just like men and women. Okay? So, let's see what's that horse name, okay? It's in here. His name is Pala Vicini. Okay, Palavicini is a, uh, what do you call this, 2017 stud fee on application. Half brother to Elusive. Pimpered from family Snow Perry and Big Bad Bud. Or oh, responsible for Charmandal and Lopi de Vega. Okay, I don't know uh, what kind of uh, race he won. But uh, as you can see, it's a special horse because he has his own cage. Okay, how about here? As you can see, during uh, today's about autumn, autumn or fall is when the leaves start to fall. Yeah, you know what fall means? The leaves are starting to fall. Okay, that's the Irish uh, scarecrow, the crow. It's not a scarecrow, it's a crow. Okay, scarecrow something that looks like a mummy wrapped in the clothes. Okay, I'm being that now. Let's walk faster, faster and faster, okay? This is me, the today's uh, tour guide here in the famous... Uh, stud uh, farm in Ireland okay so okay now the tour guide uh, just told us that the horses here are tired old and also just like women they get sick also they get rheumatism so that's why they were a uh, a jacket oh lots of Irish uh, crows okay you see that Irish crows yeah it's very famous here in Ireland the Irish crows okay crow c-r-o-w-s okay as you can see uh, he's getting cold maybe that's why uh, he's getting some sunlight that's the uh, some Irish sunlight here in Ireland okay yeah, let's walk Well, by now it's uh, 10 degrees here in Ireland, it's getting cold, but as you can see, I'm wearing a very famous uh, Irish jacket, yeah, very famous Irish jacket, it's uh, very uh, warm and thick, but uh, it's, it's thin, but uh, you, you know, in Ireland, uh, they make a fine uh, sweatshirt too, you will not get cold even in snow, okay, bye-bye. Here in 
uh, Ireland's world famous uh, horse, uh, uh, what do you call this, nursery or academy where the world's fastest horses were made. Okay? See it, the Japanese garden here, this is where they relax the horses, especially when they retire. Okay? Okay, bye bye. Okay, right now we're here in uh, Kilkenny Castle. Okay, this is the view of the Kilkenny Castle. Kilkenny Castle is, is here in Ireland. Ireland, you know Ireland, where the famous Irish coffee was made. Okay, see the tower? Okay, uh, this is the castle where the famous uh, King Kenny was killed. Okay, that's why it's called Kill Kenny Castle. Okay, right here, uh, I want to show you the, the uh, aspiring golf course here in Kill Kenny Castle. Okay, see the landscape? It's beautiful, okay. Right there, you will see two Irish women, maybe. And right here, let's see what's inside. Okay. Medieval room audiovisual, okay. Right over there, that's my wife again, in fashion clothes. Okay, we're uh, here on day uh, day ten of our tour here here in England, Ireland, and Scotland. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. I'll see you can see the 360 degrees of the Kilkenny Castle. Okay. Okay, we are now here in Waterford, uh, in Ireland, yeah, the Waterfall Crystal is here, it's very famous for uh, crystals making here, around the world, you see the crystals here, it's very huge, huge crystals, you can see, huh, it's some kind of uh, expensive, expensive item here, in Waterford okay and then uh, what else you can find a museum there where you can find lots and lots of crystals maybe inside of course and then uh, so what else it's a nice uh, new almost new city Okay, with the uh, nice uh, pavements and uh, nice people here. Okay, right now, let us uh, go back in time. Okay, hi, say hi, say hi. What a nice dress. Is that uh, a Gucci or a Copacabana, Copacabana dress? <laughs> Ah, uh, Dolce Gabbana, I mean. Okay, uh, that, that's a nice dress. Uh, okay, and then, uh, we are going to the, no, huh, to our group and listen what they are telling us about the city. Okay, Polish building. Okay, right now, we are in front of the uh, Waterfall Crystal Hotel. Okay. Okay, so the bus is not here yet. What else do we expect or what else are we waiting? I don't know. Actually, I don't know. Okay. 960. What? 960 yeah. degrees? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a new uh, angle, no? 960 degrees. Okay. Falls away. Slightly dramatic. Slightly. So what Aquinas is doing now, he takes that 
and he puts it into our skillet to be in the As I said, very unusual to see. We're usually making those regular production pieces, okay? It's a one-off. Yeah, these guys work a nine-hour day. We do three days off, four days off, four days off. Three days off. Probably no one here Okay, we are now here in Waterford Crystal uh, making, you know, they make the uh, most expensive glasses, vases, and uh, anything uh, crystal, okay? From chandeliers, wine caskets, to uh, everything made of glass, okay? So right now you see that they are slicing the glasses into pieces. Okay. There's only one problem in Oregon. I love it so much now. It's a big, big uh, factory. Okay. As you can see. So how is your tour? Say hi. Say hi. This area is called a the one rear yeah, yeah. Okay, now we're here in the water for the finest uh, crystal making in the world in Ireland.